I'm here at the entrance to the J Covered Bridge in J, New York. It's one of two covered bridges left standing in the Adirondacks. And there is a geocache in here. Let's go find it. This is one of the bigger covered bridges I've seen. And it's in such a gorgeous landscape. I just love the smell of the wood. And that view. Oh man. That is just gorgeous. It says it's a size small, and it's spinning right around here somewhere. So it could be on this side, could be somewhere over here. The difficulty was a three, but the terrain was only uh, between a one and a one and a half. So can't be that hard. No. Could be tucked away in here. Whoa. All right. I don't want to drop my phone because that goes all the way down to the river. Yeah, let's not drop our phone down there. Oh, is it something up here maybe? This is a little further away, but there is some sort of electric box or something right there. I don't know. That looks real to me. There are some children coming, so I will pause right here and enjoy the view and I'll be right back. Our pedestrians have left and I just found the geocache while I was waiting here for people to walk by. And it's a really, really good hide. Take a look at this. See this board right here? I think that's our geocache. Looks pretty suspicious to me. Oh yeah. There it is. It's a key holder glued to this board. And just like I showed you before, those slots, they go all the way down. So there we go. There's our geocache, hidden in the planks of a covered bridge. That is so cool. Oh yeah. There's our logbook. Yeah, these just go all the way down to the water. So I hope that glue holds pretty well. I don't want to drop the logbook down below the bridge because that will not be coming back. Here we go. And there's no one here, so let's just hide that back there. And it's ready for the next finder. What an amazing cache.